Is your debt problem a ticking time bomb? Thanks to a new financial consumer relief program designed in response to the economic crisis facing millions of Americans, you don't have to wait until it's too late to defuse your debt. If you owe $10,000 or more in credit card bills and are struggling to make minimum payments, get ready to take down this number for free information that could potentially save your home, the lifestyle you're accustomed to, and your family's financial well-being. But don't wait. Studies show that if most debt problems are confronted directly, beneficial settlements, manageable monthly payments and quick restoration of credit are more easily attained, potentially saving you thousands of dollars in interest charges, fees, and unpaid debt. Don't procrastinate. Call now for your free information and begin putting your economic house in order today. To qualify for this program, you must have $10,000 in credit card debt. Call the American Debt Associates at 800-876-2966. 800-876-2966. Again, 800-876-2966. Tyranny is here. The grim future foretold in 1984 has become reality. It really says that the state is God. The United States is now recognized globally as one of the most oppressive police states on Earth. This film conclusively proves the existence of a secret network of FEMA camps now being expanded nationwide. This documentary exposes how the continuity of government program has established an all-powerful shadow state. Police State 4 chronicles the sickening depths to which our republic has fallen. Prepare to enter the secretive world of emergency dictatorship. Body scanners, sound cameras, citizen spies, stage terror and cameras on every street corner. It's only the beginning of the New World Order's hellish plan. The police state isn't coming. It's here. Secure your copy today at Infowars.com or see it online in the highest quality at PrisonPlanet.tv. As many people know, ever since President Nixon took us off the gold standard, the U.S. dollar has been devaluating. What people don't know, however, is how this directly affects your personal finances. Is there a way to prevent your portfolios from losing value? The answer to all of this is gold and silver. They've both maintained their purchasing power for 6,000 years. If you had had $100,000 in cash and $100,000 in gold and silver back in 1913 and kept them both until now, your cash would actually have the buying power of only $4,800, but your gold and silver would have the buying power of $3 million. The answer to protecting your assets is simple. Call me, John Ballman, today at 1-800-686-2237, extension 169. Get all your questions answered before your money is worth zero. Call 1-800-686-2237, extension 169. Take action today while we still accept paper dollars for gold. That's 1-800-686-2237, extension 169. Global meltdowns, massive unemployment, endless wars, a new currency crisis, financially and morally bankrupt. A great and terrible storm is approaching. So what's the best way to get ready to get prepared for hard times ahead? In producing Off the Grid News, a weekly newsletter for independent patriots who want practical advice on how to survive and prosper in an increasingly dangerous world. It's the best way to get a black belt in emergency preparedness, survival skills, and off the grid living. Off the Grid News is fiercely independent all about self-reliance and packed with helpful information on survival gardening, food preparation, alternative energy, herbal medicines, privacy and security, as well as God, gold, and guns with absolutely no apologies. And the best part, this $100 a year service is now free of charge for our listeners. That's right, free for our listeners who sign up at offthegridnews.com. That's offthegridnews.com. You can sign up free at offthegridnews.com. Offthegridnews.com. Okay, I said I get to your calls. Just we're all over the map here, but it's always an informative and enlightening conversation with Joel Skelson. Uh, let's at least get to these five callers. Michael in Texas, you're on the air. Go ahead. Hey, folks, uh, thanks for taking the call. Alex, first of all, I just want to let you know, I, I feel your pain. Sometimes when I'm listening to the program and I hear, I almost have tears in my eyes because just you, this is a natural human emotion to be angry and to, 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 to want to warn your fellow man. You have out love, you know, outgoing love and concern for people. So don't you ever feel bad that you're getting angry or animated about this. It's the dumbed-down... Uh, drugged up, uh, fluoridated society that is just 
turned into zombies that that is the 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 antithesis of what we should be well michael it's just that it's just that when i talk about being upset about this stuff it's just getting worse because everything we talked about is true and worse yeah and and because i've studied history i've studied these you know scientific dictators I know their program, but to really see it now moving so quickly, and I guess it's that I have children, uh, you know, uh, eight years old, six, and two, and every time I look at them, I think about how dangerous this world is, and it just, I just wish other people would would realize how, how dangerous this is. Joel Skelson, can you comment to that for new listeners out there who, who, who tune in and may be wondering if, if this world government's real or if it is real? Maybe it's a good thing. Well, you know, intrinsically, there's nothing wrong with government at any level that defends fundamental rights in a proper way and is limited by constitutional government. You could do that at a federal level, at a state level. Uh, or even at a, at a world level, but uh, that isn't where they're headed. There is a conspiracy for world government, uh, I can assure people. I've got the evidence to back that up, and uh, uh, there is a, a major movement to project that. And uh, uh, frankly, they're, uh, they're making progress, uh, they, but you know, we are winning right now the information war uh, in, in good portion because of your work, Alex. Uh, I mean, over 35% of Americans doubt whether the president of the United States is an actual, is eligible to run for office. 30-some percent. But we know I mean, he's not. I mean, forget half, the, uh, exactly. Half don't believe the government, uh, you know, story on 9-11. And yet, uh, so the, the establishment's very, very worried about where we're going. Now, that's why I believe, Alex, that they're going to pull a war on us to bring people into line, to make people forget about their doubts. Uh, War someday is going to be the big stick that's going to knock people over the head and bring them into line. I agree with you, but I want to get a final comment from Michael. But 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 finishing up on that topic, uh, there's no doubt he gave up his citizenship to become an Indonesian citizen and took the name Barry Sitaro. And now Wayne Madsen, you were on with him uh, or right after him last week. Wayne Madsen got the other school certificate with another name. I mean, this guy's right. got this guy's got you know more names than uh, th than a South American drug lord. I mean, he, he's he's bottom line. Who is Barack Obama from your research? Well, Barack Obama, in my opinion, was uh, someone who was born and raised in a leftist environment, and at some point he got brought into the New World Order, uh, and I think it was through a. Uh, a CIA offer when he was at Occidental uh, College, and then he went on to Columbia was a ruse. I think he was working undercover for the CIA and occasionally attending uh, from there on. But at some point, you know, you, you take a leftist, and he still acted the part of a leftist, but he'd been bought and sold. And the, the proof of that, of course, when they make him wealthy. I mean, how does a, a fourth-rate uh, attorney, who, by the way, lost his license in 2008, uh, gave up his license because uh, to avoid charges that he had lied on his bar uh, association application. I mean, this guy's a fraud from the very beginning, but the real sign is when they make him wealthy, you know that a fourth-rate lawyer working for community services isn't going to make enough to buy a $9 million property you know, in uh, Hawaii or a $1.5 million house in, uh, in Chicago. This guy's been uh, uh, you know, co-opted, and I think he's a controlled entity. Yeah, there's no doubt about that. Anything else, Michael, in Texas? Oh, yeah. I'm, my son is 10 years old now. I, I was w woken up because I saw him uh, damaged by these MMR vaccines. And one of he's autistic. I mean, he's a wonderful little guy, but he, he, I have the same feelings you have, Alex. You look at your children every day and you just say, what if, what if? But the question I would have, and I'll hang up if you can comment on it, is how do we get through to people that appear to be waking, uh, are waking up? In, in other words... People in America are very superficial. They don't dig in. And there's a lot of truth mixed with error. Let's say if, um, Glenn Beck, for example, talks about the Constitution. Right there, people who believe in the Constitution automatically think, well, see, I'll side with him because he talks about the Constitution. How do we get through to people and show them that there's really no difference between who's behind the scenes in the Democratic and Republican Stay there. Party? Let's get Joel Scalzi's take. We're on the march. The Empire's on the run. Alex Jones and the GCN Radio Network. You may be arrested and or subject to other police action.
tyranny is here. The grim future foretold in 1984 has become reality. It really says that the state is God. The United States is now recognized globally as one of the most oppressive police states on Earth. This film conclusively proves the existence of a secret network of FEMA camps now being expanded nationwide. This documentary exposes how the continuity of government program has established an all-powerful shadow state. Police State 4 chronicles the sickening depth to which our republic has fallen. Prepare to enter the secretive world of emergency dictatorship. Body scanners, sound cameras, citizen spies, stage terror and cameras on every street corner. It's only the beginning of the New World Order's hellish plan. The police state isn't coming. It's here. Secure your copy today at Infowars.com or see it online in the highest quality at PrisonPlanet.tv. You've heard Alex explain how the Silver Lungs Generator infuses the respiratory system with your self-produced colloidal silver solutions, yet many are unaware of the entire function of the Silver Lung System and how it has been designed to deliver your silver solutions anywhere in or on the body. My name is Mario Cifaldi, and I'm the developer of the Silver Lungs Generator. Not only does the Silver Lung System produce endless colloidal and ionic silver solutions, it also comes equipped with the proper applicators and devices needed to deliver your silver solutions directly to key target areas. This includes the eyes, ears, nose, lungs, topically to the skin, and orally for the digestive system. Be sure to watch our new 7-minute video tour of the Silver Lung System at www.silverlungs.com to learn more about how the Silver Lung System works. As well, we are always ready to answer any questions you may have. That's www.silverlungs.com. Alex Jones here with urgent information concerning TrendsResearch.com. The Trends Journal distills the voluminous ongoing research of the Trends Research Institute into a concise, readily accessible form. By tracking 300 separately defined domestic and international trends, the Trends Journal establishes the connections that others fail to see or misinterpret. Gerald Salente's Trends Journal allows you to anticipate change, recognize the implications, and take protective strategies. Individual readers from every walk of life can put the Trends Journal Trends Forecast and Trends Analysis to practical use. Extra information to keep you well informed throughout the year. When any current event of major social, economic, or political significance occurs, Trends Journal notifies its subscribers of their implications. When you subscribe to the Trends Journal, you'll also receive Trends Alerts. Visit TrendsResearch.com today. That's TrendsResearch.com. Subscribe to the Trends Journal. This information is too important to wait. From the front lines of the information war, it's Alex Jones. Well, Joel Skousen is our guest, worldaffairsbrief.com, and valuable information. Go there and subscribe to it. And uh, I tell you, I really do agree with his analysis and his breakdown on so many so many subjects, uh, especially on the Glenn Beck thing, the way Glenn Beck is so erratic uh, and, and is, is always changing his views. But I do see him drifting towards more and more truth. Uh, I want to answer that caller's question about how do you reach out to people to know the difference between a Sarah Palin kind of Republicanoid awakening, uh, you know, just like Keith Oberman was exposing tyranny when Bush was in. But as soon as Obama's in, you know, he's now supporting it. How do we stop this two-party tag teaming? Uh, but 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 first, going into a break, you.